హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ దిస్ ఇస్ స్కోడనరి జయసింహ ద ప్రెసిడెంట్ ఇండియన్ మెమరీ కౌన్సిల్ అండ్ మల్టిపుల్ గిన్నిస్ వరల్డ్ రికార్డ్ హోల్డర్ అండ్ ఫర్ లాస్ట్ ఫ్యూ ఇయర్స్ హ్యాడ్ బీన్ ట్రావెలింగ్ ఇన్ డిఫరెంట్ సిటీస్ ఇన్ ఇండియా అండ్ అబ్రాడ్ అండ్ ఐ ట్రైన్ పీపుల్ ఆన్ మెమరీ బట్ వేర్ ఎవర్ ఐ గో మ్యాక్సిమమ్ పీపుల్ హూ అటెండ్ మై మెమరీ వర్క్షాప్ ఆర్ ద స్టూడెంట్స్ బికాస్ వీ హ్యావ్ గివెన్ ఎ కనటేషన్ ఎగ్జామ్ మీన్స్ మెమరీ మెమరీ మీన్స్ ఎగ్జామ్ నా మెనీ పీపుల్ హూ గాట్ ఇన్ టు జాబ్ హూ ఆర్ ఇన్ టు బిజినెస్ హూ ఆర్ రిటైర్డ్ పీపుల్ హూ ఆర్ హోమ్ మేకర్స్ దే థింక్ దే డోంట్ నీడ్ మెమరీ అండ్ వీ హ్యావ్ ఓన్లీ కన్స్టైన్డ్ మెమరీ ఓన్లీ ఫర్ ఎగ్జామ్స్ బట్ వన్ థింగ్ వీ షుడ్ అండర్స్టాండ్ మెమరీ ఈజ్ లైఫ్ అండ్ లైఫ్ ఈజ్ మెమరీ వాట్ ఆర్ యూ యూ ఆర్ యూ ఆర్ మెమరీ ఇఫ్ ఐ టేక్ అవుట్ దట్ మెమరీ ఫ్రమ్ యర్ బ్రెయిన్ యూ బికమ్ వెజిటబుల్ మీన్స్ యూ ఆర్ దేర్ యూ ఆర్ నాట్ దేర్ ఇమాజిన్ ఐ ఎమ్ టాకింగ్ రైట్ నా ఆఫ్టర్ దిస్ వీడియో ఐ నీడ్ టు గో హోమ్ ఐ ఫర్గట్ మై హోమ్ అండ్ ఐ గో టు సమ్ నేబర్స్ హౌస్ దెన్ వాట్ హ్యాపెన్ ఇఫ్ ఐ ఫర్గెట్ ద రూట్ బ్యాక్ టు మై హౌస్ ఇఫ్ ఐ ఫర్గెట్ మై ఓన్ నేమ్ ఇఫ్ ఐ కాంట్ ఐడెంటిఫై మై ఓన్ ఫ్యామిలీ మెంబర్స్ దెన్ వాట్ ద యూస్ ఆఫ్ మీ బీయింగ్ దే అండ్ వన్ థింగ్ యు నో వై పీపుల్ నెగ్లెక్ట్ మెమరీస్ దెన్ టేక్ మెమరీ ఫర్ గ్రాంటెడ్ ఇట్ హెస్ కమ్ ఫ్రీ ఆఫ్ కాస్ట్ నో వెన్ యూ బై టూ జీబీ మెమరీ చిప్ ఫ్రమ్ ఎ మొబైల్ షాప్ ఆర్ యూ బై అ ల్యాప్టాప్ విత్ హై మెమరీ నా యూనిట్ పే సో మచ్ అమౌంట్ బట్ గాట్ ఈస్ గివెన్ హండ్రెడ్ బిలియన్ న్యూరాన్ సెల్స్ మెమరీ అండ్ వన్ సెల్ ఈస్ ఇక్వల్ టు వర్ సూపర్ కంప్యూటర్స్ డాక్టర్ సే ఇఫ్ యూ రీడ్ ఎవ్రీ బుక్ రిటర్న్ బై ఎవ్రీ ఆథర్ ఇన్ ద హోల్ వరల్డ్ యూ కాంట్ ఈవెన్ ఫిల్ నో ట్వంటీ పర్సెంట్ ఆఫ్ ద బ్రెయిన్ దట్ ఈస్ ద బ్రెయిన్ బట్ ద ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఇస్ ఇట్ హస్ కమ్ ఫ్రీలీ సో యూ డోంట్ కేర్ ద మీన్స్ ఎనీథింగ్ యూ నో అవర్ హ్యూమన్ సైకాలజీస్ బిఫోర్ యూ హ్యావ్ ఇట్ విల్ బి క్రేవింగ్ టు పర్సెస్ ఇట్ సో ద మూమెంట్ యూ లూజ్ ఇట్ అగైన్ యూ రిగ్రెట్ దట్ యూ లాస్ట్ ఇట్ ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ యూ ఆర్ అన్మ్యారీడ్ యు ఆర్ ఇన్ లవ్ టిల్ దట్ గర్ల్ సేస్ ఎస్ టు యూ ఆర్ ప్రపోజల్ యుల్ బి రోమింగ్ అరౌండ్ హర్ ద మూమెంట్ షీ వుడ్ సే ఎస్ అండ్ యూ బికమ్ హస్బెండ్ వైఫ్ యూ టేక్ హర్ ఫర్ గ్రాంటెడ్ అండ్ బికాస్ షీ ఈస్ యువర్ వైఫ్ రైట్ నా అండ్ లుక్ ఎట్ యర్ మామ్ వెన్ షీ ఈస్ అలైవ్ we don't have time to talk to her but the moment she passes away that's when everyone will go and cry means before you have it you'll be craving to have it and once you lose it no again you regret and brain wh report it says today in the whole universe people are above 40 years 80% people are suffering from this called alzheimer's dementia means if you neglect to protect this memory soon you will be hearing this term called alzheimer's dementia from a medical doctor but you can actually protect yourself from this memory as long as you are there you can have wonderful memory the most important thing what can be done so the brain has got one formula use it or lose it miss brain works like a knife in the kitchen so if you are using it it remains sharp imagine six months you don't use the knife it becomes blunt it gets corroded it gets rusted correct now the brain also same thing use it or lose it see now if i cut my hair again it will grow if i cut my nails they grow again if i you know if the skin goes again it grows but the neurons in the brain once they die they don't take birth again that means you need to protect these neurons what happened is till you are in the school or a college till you got a job till you got settled in the business you had been learning something you have been very creative very innovative and you are in the pursuit of knowledge but the moment you got a job and it becomes quite mundane and routine for all of us the moment your business is settled you stop learning that's the reason why the neurons keep dying uh, no new neural pathways gets formed and that's the reason why our memory keeps coming down so what is the plan as we keep aging you want to have a good memory number 1 is you have to be a student of life throughout life means keep reading when was the last time put a hand on heart and ask this question you spent 500 rupees and bought a book never after your college after the computer exam never you bought so you need to keep reading as many books as possible jaisima i don't need to read the books then what to do you have that you know intention that wish of you becoming you know doing one grad post graduation ma public admin or i want to do msc i want to learn ma arts some new qualification you can always pursue that's what you can do so keep reading books at least one book per month second thing is you can attend some training program when was the last time you spent 20000 to learn about stock market about real estate about mutual funds about politics or about your own field that you are into training for example how can i become a good speaker how can i become a good teacher 
When was the last time you invested 25,000 rupees lent? Long, long ago. So that's another problem. Third thing is, we can keep learning a new skill. Means what? You can let dance. You say, Jason Master, already I'm 50 years old. You think I could learn dance? Anywhere it is written that as you keep aging, you should not learn dance. You can always learn Kathakali, Kuchipudi, Bharatanatyam. You can learn some music. And gentlemen, you also can learn how to play violin. Or you can play, uh, you learn to play guitar. You can play, you can learn to play tabla. And that will open new neural pathways in the brain. And you will really, you know, uh, thank me for this one advice. Keep learning some new skill. Means every day, there is something that you look up to that I'm going to learn, okay? And you can learn that mouth organ, you know, you can play. I want to learn some new skill. Maybe I want to learn river rafting. I want to learn some driving. I want to learn swimming. I want to learn some new skill. And that's one of the best things that you can do. Next thing is you always can learn a new language. One of the most beautiful ways. Learn. P.V. Narsimharao, our former honorable prime minister, he used to know, he, he was knowing 16 languages. So if you learn, imagine you are from you know, Bihar, you are from Madhya Pradesh, you speak Hindi, you can learn some Tamil, you can learn Malayalam, you can learn Telugu, you can learn Kannada, and you can learn English, you can learn some French or German, Spanish, Chinese, Russian, any new language you can always learn, right? So learning a new language is the most beautiful way to open up a neural pathways. And one of the best advice that I can give to all the gentlemen is, you can learn cooking. Most of us think that women are meant to uh, be there in a kitchen and they are supposed to cook and we gentlemen are supposed to eat. Nowhere it is written that, that only you know, women should cook and learn cooking. Because you no, know, I am not praising the women but let me tell you, scientifically it is proven that when people, you know, uh, when they mix ingredients and when you feel the aroma, either you make coffee or tea or you make dosa or you make some beautiful vegetarian dish, right? Or anything that you make, you know, that aroma will open up new neural pathways for the man. So one of the most beautiful ways is to learn cooking. And this way, you can have one good, great bond with your spouse as well. Because at least one week she is working for you and at least Sunday she needs a break. You can make one cup of coffee, one cup of tea after this seeing this video we can do that as well and what more you can do you can learn new brain you know gym exercises if you can google if you can um, do youtube lot of brain gym exercises are there and else otherwise i will show you in the next video how to do brain gym exercise you know using left hand okay if you're right hander right with the left hand okay if you're walking front walk backward you count numbers one to hundred numbers now hundred back to one you count okay now use different parts of the brain so that parts of the body so that your left and right brain both of them become very active for you very very active so different different brain gym exercises are there and if you go to different abacus classes they teach mid brain activation they teach brain gym exercises and even your in our memory workshops we do train children on the brain gym exercises if nothing else you can play chess you can uh, solve sudoku puzzles you can fill in some puzzles that are there in a, in a magazine newspaper somewhere you can solve those puzzles you can attend some intellectual debates discussion you can go to some sammelan where come some kavi sammelan or when people meet up and they discuss no you can take part in this kind of thing as well or what you can do is daily you drive from home to office in the same route right brain goes to sleep now tomorrow what you do when you go to office or you go to a shop try to take a new route that's when brain becomes so alert and you will be able to observe that so you need to have one plan what is it that i can do to make my brain that much more active so either you keep reading a book or you keep learning new language learn some new skill and then new path that you can take up now do some brain gym exercises, solve some puzzles or get into some mental activities. And most important thing is, every day, most people after retirement, they think that nothing I've got. We become couch potatoes, miss. We just sit in the, in the sofa, watch TV, eat and sleep. And that's what will happen is, your body will start decaying. Along with the body, your brain cells to decay. And people are supposed to be living healthily, now, physically and mentally active up to 100 years. But because you don't have any navigation, you have no activity, eating, sleeping, getting up. Eating, sleeping, getting up. Only these three things that you do. And because you are a pensioner, you are a retired person, there is nothing active that is happening in life, right? 
and people go through motions of life and there is no excitement there is no fun in life as well now that's the reason why the memory keeps coming down and because of which people they get victimized for this alzheimer dementia and most important thing is three things i will tell you eat proper food very important and do spend some time every day half an hour doing some exercise other you do yoga you go for a walk you be in the gym or you know some exercise that you can do that physically active and third thing is sleep daily same time you sleep same time you get up and minimum 7 hours of sleep and sunday you can extend that up to 8 hours of sleep if you can follow this means if you are physically you know fit and then there's every day morning i got some navigation i've got some activity i got something to do and i am learning something so if you have that life will be so beautiful you'll have a wonderful memory so don't ever feel that at this age can i start again there's nothing that stops you from starting a new phase of life you can always start at any time no you can start learning magic you can learn starting giving a speech you can learn becoming a teacher you can learn becoming a you know cook you can do anything if only you wish to become something in life okay so if you can do this you can never become you know victim of alzheimer's dementia so all these people who are settled in job especially homemakers and also most importantly people who are retired right you need to follow these things so that your day becomes very very tight and busy busy you remain and actively productively and then profitably you use your time so that at the end of the day you are having intellectual satisfaction and also physically you get tired and you know you contribute something to yourself and also to the whole huma- whole humanity and that way you will have lot of satisfaction and that also you will have super memory power as well so never you can become victim of alzheimer's dementia follow these things and if you need more advice jaisama mind education that the company that i run we run special memory classes for the children and also adults you can call up the numbers calling by and would love to help you to learn proper memory techniques where you can memorize different speeches text numerical data equation formulas okay i would love to see you in one of the workshops but till then keep following us in different different you no know, youtube videos and i'll keep helping you until we meet next so this is skonjay sama signing off rorkela odisha love you all bye bye